Number two. The X-Files from 2011. This was the second ever Nostalgia Wayne intro, and after it came back in 2018, with it being re-uploaded due to a copyright claim, this was one of my favorite Nostalgia Wayne intros, with seeing really cool Halloween things like Casper, Pennywise, Paranormal Activity, the first one, the Nostalgia Critic on the Department of Criticism, FBI Special Agent, NC name tag starring the Nostalgia Critic Charlie Brown in his ghost costume I had a little trouble with the scissors and my favorite part in here is when the Nostalgia Critic secretly quietly walks out of a room carrying a flashlight because he wants to see what's going on only to lose his balance and fall down a small flight of stairs See what I mean? Don't worry, the Nostalgia Critic is fine. The reviews he did on here were The Tommyknockers, the 1999 version of The Haunting, sorry, Nostalgia Critic, Blair Witch 2, Book of Shadows, sorry, Austin Putnam, and Exorcist 2, The Heretic. Honestly, the only thing that I'm there for is listening to, is listening to Linda Blair speak very soft, like she has a southern accent. Born in St. Louis, Missouri. I have a southern accent, but it's not a very thick one. I love southern accents, though. And, yeah. Definitely one of my favorite Nostalgia Wayne intros, and I will not X this one out, but I will give it a check for being an awesome Nostalgia Wayne intro. But as awesome as this one is, it's not as much fun as my number one favorite Nostalgia Wayne intro. What is it? I think everyone knows what it is, but here we go. My number one favorite Nostalgia Ween intro is... The Real Ghostbusters from 2020. As bad of a year as 2020 was, that year still gave us, in my opinion, the best Nostalgia Ween intro ever. I love this intro. I love the music, I love the, the song, which you're going to watch by Jan, who, shout out to her, gave a really awesome music for this one here. The characters are imitating Ghostbusters, like, for example, the first Ghostbusters with Bill Murray, Dan Aykroyd, Harold Ramis, and Ernie Hudson. Really, this is them doing a parody of the real Ghostbusters, which ran for seven seasons and well over 100 episodes before getting axed. And, yeah. I just did the Boobahs doing warm dances and end dances to the real Ghostbusters theme song and end credits, those being the Busy Dizzy Dance, Get Up and Gallop, Swingy Twirls, Stretch and Sway, the Twisting Dance, and Stomp Your Feet from Booba Ice Cream Cone, which, as you may remember, was my number one favorite made of Booba DVD, and an existing Booba DVD in Booba Umbrella. Yeah, and the reviews on here were The Lost Boys, the 1994 version of The Stand miniseries, the original The Witches from 1990, Scary Stories to Tell in the Dark, I love Zoe Coletti's voice, it makes me laugh with her, and a short version of this intro is in Tusk. I'd rather watch Justin Long and Live Free or Die Hard. So, yeah. Yeah, I love this intro, I love everything about it. This is my number one favorite Nostalgia Wayne intro, The Real Ghostbusters, what you gonna watch? An awesome an amazing Nostalgia Ween intro with perfect excitement to it while watching these reviews. So, thank you very much for watching my top 13 favorite Nostalgia Ween intros. 
and we're getting started on this new season. Thank you very much for watching, and I'm thinking about doing another Top 13 list next time, this time involving animals, because of an anniversary tomorrow. What anniversary is it? Well, it's Tough Puppy, but animals? We'll find out tomorrow on William Wise's Shot Fierce. Until then, happy early Halloween, and don't get scared.